Hey folks, Reds here. We're back in the uh, at the home court, the shave den of Ruds. Um, flew home today from Pueblo, so I'm gonna do a uh, soap review tonight. Katie's Bubbles, Carnivus, and Richardson collab. This is the port strengths. Uh, many of you have seen my discussion on the Chatillon Lux Carnivus and Richardson collab, which is the uh, Le Basson Sur la Poche Porch Drinks. This is the uh, matching soap. This was made by uh, Chris Collin over at Katie's Bubbles. So let me uh, show you the gear I'm going to be using today in a photo. As you can see, it's top quality stuff. I'm going to get the uh, lather going here in a moment. We'll talk about the scent. Then we'll fast forward to uh, a little bit of the shave, talk about performance. And then we'll wrap it up with the little overall impressions at the end of the shave. You can see we're all loaded up here. The uh, scent profile on this as described on the label is uh, coffee, cardamom, blood orange, tobacco, and bourbon. To my nose, I get the cardamom and the bourbon first, and then I get some uh, blood orange, coffee, and then a little hint of tobacco towards the uh, back end of the note, or the uh, blend, I should say. Um, the scent strength is mid-strong, both from the puck and as I lather it, definitely retaining its uh, potency. I'd say this scent is uh, quite unique. Um, nothing comes to mind that's uh, got enough similar notes to uh, be comparable in my opinion. All right, we're gonna get started here. I uh, intentionally left my face growing the uh, last few days of the trip so I could really put this soap to the test Katie's Bubbles has a uh, unbelievable um, slickness and cushion for a vegan soap particularly the cushion in my opinion is about as voluminous as it gets. This is the luxury soap formula, so many of you already know how uh, wonderfully this performs. And as you can see, three days growth gone in an instant no weepers no nicks and I expect that to continue on this side all right we're back when you uh, finish the shave with the matching splash we'll talk about some overall impressions um, I failed to mention the tobacco note is like um, uh, almost like a black pipe tobacco. It's not cherry. Uh, it's not fresh tobacco. It's not smoked tobacco. It's pipe tobacco. Uh, very nice. I will note that on the splash, the orange starts off as the dominant note to my nose, and then the bourbon. It's a great scent, though, overall. Now the availability of this is um, pretty limited right now, but 
I think it will be popular enough that Josh from uh, Carnivus and Richardson will end up uh, asking the two artisans to collab again and uh, make at least another batch, if not make this a uh, standard product offering. So, if you can get your hands on it, do. This is uh, Carnivus and Bubbles Porch Drinks. Great performance, great scent, great post shave, and uh, really some stand up people came together to produce this soap. So, way in the splash, too. All right, folks, that's going to do it for me. I got a little bit of jet lag. I'm going to spend some more time with the family. I'll see you this weekend for some more reviews. Take care.